In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix it when your Xbox Series S or X isn't connecting to the Xbox app on your phone. So the first thing you want to do is go into your Xbox and go to the settings cogwheel in the top right corner. Then we're going to scroll down to devices and connections and we're going to select remote features. Now we're going to be enabling remote features and this is going to test our network setup to ensure that we have enough speed to utilize a bunch of these different features. Once it's finished testing your setup, it'll show you some things you could improve and it'll say you're good to go. So let's select next. Then we're going to be closing this out. And now we're gonna be going to Xbox app preferences. Now you wanna ensure for the Xbox app that it isn't on, don't allow the Xbox app to connect. Rather, you want it on this one or this one, I'm going to select allow connections from any device. Now we're going to go to our phone and open up the Xbox app. And if it's the first time you're using it, you're going to have to sign into your Microsoft account. Then we're going to select the library icon in the bottom right corner beside our profile pic. And you'll see my Xbox is already connected. Now, if you want to connect an Xbox, select set up a console. And if you're setting up a console for the first time, you can go ahead and select the first option and you'll have to enter a code on your TV. Now, if this console has already been set up, so you've used it, let's go back to library, set up a console, and then go to add an existing console. And then you just have to follow through next and a couple of different options. And it'll show that we already have remote features enabled and it'll just take a second for us to connect to the console. But since I already am connected, it's not going to allow me to do that. But hopefully this video was helpful. Like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.